welcome back to the channel, y'all. In this video, I'm going to share with y'all about this Democrats and this Medicaid, not Medicaid, but Medicare plan and all this kind of crap that they're talking about. Now, I know y'all heard the news. All y'all that's out here that's on Medicare, uh, whatever, you know, Medicare. Now, they said the cost of COLA for people who get, I think it's SSI, SSDI, veterans, or whoever, you know. All right, the cost of COLA is 5.9%, all right? All right, now tell me this, y'all. Now, the Democrats talking about reforming Medicare. All right, now they talking about putting hearing in the bill, reforming it just, just for uh, ears and stuff like that, hearing, which is crap. You know, it really ain't helping nobody too much, you know. Now, the thing is, how do the people get, all right, they done gave everybody raises. They gave out child tax credit increases. All right, I'm talking increase. Now, they saying the child tax credit has been around. Child tax credit has been around. But the thing is, they increased it. All right, now, when they increased the COLA for Social Security, SSI, SSDI, and veterans, they increased the COLA. 5.9%. But here's the thing. Medicare went up. Now, I don't know a veteran. I think they get free health care. I don't know how that goes. But here's the thing. Uh, the thing is, they, when people on SSI, SSDI, and stuff like that, when their Medicare go up, that cuts into their COLA premium, which I think is unfair. You know, I think people on SSI, SSDI, whatever, they should be a railroad. They should be able to opt out of that crap. You know, um, I think I think it's Medicare Part B, which is going up twenty one dollars and sixty cents. All right, now how is that really helping people on Social Security, SSI, SSDI, when you get a five point nine percent raise, but then Medicare go up, and they're cutting into your raise by twenty one dollars and sixty cents. How's that happen? Now they talking about reforming Medicare. They need it. They need to fix that issue. They need to fix that. They need to stop Medicare from going up every time Social Security get a raise. That's what the Democrats and the Republicans need to do. They need to fix that issue right there first, because when you truly get a cola increase, truly get a raise, the raise should be the raise. It should be capped off where it can't nobody cut into your raise because the raise is for you. No, it's not for Medicare. Why Medicare got to keep going up every time people get a raise in their Social Security check? That's the problem they need to fix. They need to start right there. They need to fix that issue right there. Right there. That's where they need to start at, right there. They're talking about reforming it to you. Dental vision and all this kind of crap. Man, take care of your teeth and your eyes and stuff. You ain't got to worry about nothing that's still you brush your teeth every day. You know what I'm saying? Take care of your teeth. You ain't got to worry about the dentist either. You know, people don't go to the dentist every day. Take myself. I brush my teeth three times a day. You know, I take care of my teeth. Take care of your teeth and all that stuff. You ain't got to worry about no dentists too much. See? So I just don't get it. Now that's what they need to reform how Medicare go up part B and butt into people raises. That's what the Democrats and stuff need to be looking into instead of reforming it. And in my opinion, you should be able to opt out of this crap. You know, like if you don't really want Medicare, you should be able to opt out and get into some other kind of health care coverage that you're comfortable with that's cheaper for the people. You know, because Medicare costs $170 a month pretty soon for people. Well, you probably can find some kind of health care insurance out here and probably pay about $60, $75 a month for it, which will save you almost $100. Now, that's where it should be. Because Part A and Part B, they make you buy it. As long as you're on SSI, uh, SSDI, I think it is. SSI, I think they get Medicaid. But that's going up. Same thing. So, so, it should be a way you can opt out of this stuff, um, especially people on SSDI. You know, should be able to opt out of these 
part A and part B and find your own health care coverage. You can find your own health care coverage for much cheaper than paying for that Medicare crap. What y'all think about it? Because in, in order for you to be on, I think in order for you to be on SSDI, SSDI, you got to have part A and part B. See, you got to pay for that, which is through Medicare. If you opt out of that, then you they'll cut your check off, which is crazy. Now, that's the problem they need to fix right there. should be optional. If you don't want part B and all that stuff, you should better go out here and find your own coverage. That's what I think. Yeah, because they need to put a cap on that so it can stop budding until people raises. Every time you get a cola increase, Medicare go up. Medicaid go up. See, they always eat right into your raise. That junk ain't right, man. They need to do something about that crap. They talk about reforming Medicare. They need to reform how they butt into people's raises. That's what they need to do. Should put a cap on it. A cap. If you get a $75 raise, it should be a $75 raise. And Medicare shouldn't go up because you got a $75 raise. That's crap, man. That's what Democrats need to be working on. They talk about reforming to Medicare. <laughs> And need to reform how they butt into people's uh, cost of living adjustments. That's what I think. Y'all hit me in the comment section. All about peace.